15 knots coming down the ridge line, which is going to make it very challenging. And there's our runway. Let's go. I'm terrible in this aeroplane, but let's give it a go. So, uh, AP off. Make sure the autopilot is off. AP, AP. I'm just trying to work out how they do. It doesn't look like it's on. No, it's not on. There's no AP on. Cool. Uh, we need to check configuration. I have gear down. Do I have flaps? Flaps is takeoff flaps. Okay. Setting landing flaps. Checking speed and feeling the aircraft because I haven't flown this in a while. Um, Retrimming the aeroplane. And there's our landing there. Okay. So if I haven't, somebody, anybody hasn't seen it, it's a, it's a single engine turboprop. It's a bit of a sports car. It's like the sports car of uh, turbo props. this thing. Um, I'm not a fan of it. I need to trim this out a lot. Trim, 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 trim. More trim, more trim. Okay, trim feels good. And we have a four white, so we need to drop. So I'm cutting the throttle and dropping the... Air. Oh, mind you, looking at this, we're going to be flying over this, rear, this, this valley onto a plateau with the wind coming down from there. I think we're going to get buffeted just before we cross that um, that uh, valley onto the plateau where the airfield is. This is going to be interesting. Right, OK, so the wind is coming from that side. I can't actually feel it yet. So I need to move this way to get lined up. And we need to drop. First attempt at any of these landing challenges is just a feeler. It's an unre uneven runway as well. Okay, Roger that, Kaiser. Um, your first attempt is always a feeler. Uh, don't worry about your first one, unless you smash it. I don't see the blue box I'm supposed to land on, so I'm guessing it's normally next to the pappy lights. I don't see it. I'm just waiting to feel the bloody wind. I'm still too high. Diving down. I don't see the blue box. It feels fairly docile at the moment. Idle throttle. I don't see the blue box. Where am I supposed to land? I don't see it. Ah, there it is. Okay, right between the, the normal piano keys. Got it. Okay, we're very late. Nice landing, but we're very late. Brakes on. It's a light, uh, very late landing, but it was a very nice landing. Just very late. We're on centre line, and we were very smooth. So 1.2. Oh, I jumped in between the two. Not bad for a first attempt. However, where can we improve? So, our landing precision was very late. 278 feet late. That's where I can make the improvement. Our FPM was round about where you expect, around about 100 for that aeroplane. Uh, center line, we've got a bit of an improvement we can improve there, but very unlikely. For 14 feet is not for it. You know, I should be able to get it down to 10, but, you know, anywhere around 10 is okay. Uh, but this one was very late. We should be able to around about 100. 100 short or, or, or long is not a problem. 200 is a bit too much. So we should be able to cut that in half. And as long as we keep the smoothness at around about 100, 110, we're going to improve the score by about 100,000. So it's going to be around about 1.37, so around about where Mr. Kaiser is. We'll give it one more go, because I think the first one's always a bit of a feeler. Let's try it again. <coughs> but what I find usually happens when I do it again on stream is it's worse. <laughs> but anyway, here we go. Okay, so... Lift seat... Slow aircraft. Position aircraft over to the uh, right. Don't drop flaps yet, don't need to. Three green. Retrim aircraft. Trim, trim, trim. Slowing down. But anyway, nice to see you. I hope you're all doing well. Start of another week. First, first proper week in February. short month as well, isn't it? Is it leap year this year? It is! Oh, so it's a longer month than normal. Okay, flap set. Retrimmed. Just 
Just retrimming. Just dropping the speed. I want to see... I was a little fast last time. Okay, we're still a little high. I'm not going to worry about the height, because I know exactly where it is. It's on the piano keys now. I'm quite comfortable about dropping last second. But we were a little long before, so we do want to be a little lower on the approach lights. You want to improve on last time, so let's see if we can get the approach lights, the pappy lights, on 2 and 2, where we're supposed to be. So the wind should be coming from down from there, but it feels like it's coming from the other way. The wind feels like from the other side. Okay, I cannot get the Pappy light to come one red. I, I, I'm diving down way more than I think I should, and I'm still not getting one, one Pappy light to turn red. What? I feel really low now. And all the Pappy lights are white, which says, uh, for white, you're shite. Which means we're too high. For red, you're dead. No, I don't think the Pappy lights are working on this airfield, because we definitely should have one red here. So we're ignoring them. There we go. Now we've got one red. I'm ignoring them. There's, there suddenly goes three red, four red. Yeah. Um, ignore the Pappy lights here. Manual approach. Looking for the box, and we need to centre that way a bit. Again, a little late, but better centre line, and I think a little harder FPM, around about the 150, I think. It's a downhill runway. So Mr. Kaiser said it's an uneven runway. I see it is downhill. You're chasing the box. That's why we're late all the time. Nice score, see? See how we improved that, though. Look at where you can improve and aim, focus on that. So as you can see, I focused on this, kept the other two round about the same. I focused on the landing precision because we were a little long. And like I said, we should be able to get that to 100 feet. At Kaiser, but I'm just, like I say, I know I, I know I beat you, but I'm just, like I say, if, if you talk through what I'm thinking and listen to it, you, 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 under, you just see how it all worked. We kept the other two exactly the same. This is slightly worse. This is slightly better. And we just focused on our landing, uh, uh, you know, nearer the box. And I can improve that one a long way. I reckon I get that one to 1.6. Easy. Because I can get this FPM down to 80. No problem. That aeroplane, downhill runway, easily get that down to 80. If we maintain these and get this down to 80, that will take us up to 1.6. So my next focus would be the smoothness. Because it's a slight downhill, I think you can get that even smoother than 100. I normally aim for 100 with this aeroplane. But I think with a downhill runway, yeah, easy get that down to 80. So, But I'm not going to do it now. So, um, as you can see, we have improved the score. Where's the friends gone? There it is. 